how to set up unlimited free business emails hi guys today i am telling you that how you can set up unlimited free business emails in 2021 so let's get started now when we talk about business emails we get really confused that how to create a business email and what do you need to create a business email do you need your own domain do we have to create our own website where we will create our business email will our gmail work as a business email there are a lot of questions but you don't need to be worried about any of this because i'm just going to show you that what are different platforms that will help you get your business email how to get your first business email how you can actually get free domains as well that's a free thing that i will be giving away that how to create a free domain as well and then i will show you that how your business email is created and then how there is also another way that you can actually link your own gmail as your business email uh, so let's get started with all of these things so first things first what happens is that you will require a domain of course a website a business to create a business email and once you have your domain then there are many platforms out there that allow you to create your own business emails for free as well there are many that will actually charge you for that but i'm going to show you around those that are actually completely free so first thing that i want you to know is that you will require a domain and now if you do not have a domain i would suggest you go and create one of course you will have one if you're looking for a business email but if you don't it's okay you can go ahead and create your domain on wix or wordpress if you have the budget but if you're looking for a free domain then of course i am here to help go to freenorm.com and you can actually get a free domain now here's the thing when different web websites say that they have free domains they actually kind of have these plans they are like okay go up go buy a plan on e-commerce or woocommerce and then you can get a free domain as well but that's not completely free right so what happens on free norm is that you actually get these five options that are completely free so if i go with any of these let's just say that i go with my store and what happens is there are five domains that are completely free that we can actually avail you can see right here that these are the free domains that are available you can see it's completely free zero dollars you can buy it right away so if you're looking for free domains for example you can get just a little drawback to this thing is that you will get a domain of course you will get with .tk.ml.ga.cf.com G Q, but for the domains that everybody likes the domains that are actually you know out there we know how domains work right so the domains like dot com dot net dot org dot info dot eu are not available you'll actually have to pay but these are completely free so if you are looking for a domain for completely free reasons then i think you know what it's completely free you can go with these but of course if you're looking for these then you'll actually have to pay so once you have have your domain this was the first step right so you have a domain now and now you want to create a business email so what happens is there are different platforms the first one is ipage now ipage is very easy to use and completely free and it allows you to create business emails what you need to do is just go to ipage.com domains right here you will see this option and once you will go to domains then you will be able to they're actually asking you if you do not have a domain go ahead and register it if you have a domain uh, then you will definitely search for it and get a domain right here so what happens is that we already have a domain so let's just go with a random one i'm just going to show you so let's go with google.com now google.com is actually a domain right so if i go with this one let's search this up there you go they're saying that google.com this is a domain and this is what my domain is so they're saying that these different domains are also available if i want one so this is the same process they're actually you know very costly so you will get a domain you will do the add-ons and billing so this is about the 
domains so once you have your domain on ipage as well like again and again the first step to getting a business email is getting a domain right so i showed you how to get a free domain you don't have to you know go through all of these steps now it's time for email forwarding so what happens is automatically forward email address under your domain to any other valid email address we can actually you know do that as well so let's get started with email hosting right here you will see the option of email hosting email hosting means that when you have a business email ipage will allow you to host your email your even your gmail to get emails right here on your website on your domain i hope that i'm making sense so let me just explain it to you what happens is let's read right here get a professional email address with an ipage email hosting plan match your email address to your business name to establish stress so they're just now you know giving you an idea that how to get a good business email account they're saying name it with your website so you know you have an established trust then make sure that the security is good so i'm going to choose the plan which is free so you will then just select a plan and you will good to go so this is ipage and i have actually other platforms as well to show you so let's go there now here we have host gator now host gator is another platform that allows you to build your own business email for free so what happens is and the good thing is unlimited emails so again what you will require is a domain once you have your domain you can see right here they are actually telling you all of the things to do how to create a business email in four easy steps register your domain we have registered our domain sign up for a web hosting follow the instruction and then you simply add your email account so once you add your email account now here's the thing either you will create your new business email on any of the web hosting that you have selected right now here comes another point that i just you know need to clarify don't think that buying a domain i actually showed you how to get a free domain right maybe i can also show you how to get a free web hosting but there are limitations to that there will be different features that you will not be able to avail so the good thing is that you can get them for free but when it comes to the business emails it will be completely free but eventually you will actually have to buy a plan for your web hosting or for your domain so don't think that this whole process will be completely easy and you'll not have to pay a penny and you'll get a domain registered and you will get a web hosting you will get a business email you can do that for free again but that will not be the case and you know if you want to build a good professional business then i would suggest that go ahead and get a good domain for your business and after that you can actually get unlimited free email of course so once your email is actually you know created you add an account this is actually one of the examples that you can see the business email actually has dot com for your name for your email address so that's pretty good and you kind of get this professional email for yourself so you can actually you know go ahead and do that on host gator you can get your domain as well web hosting and then business email as well after that i have another thing for you which is called you can actually get your own gmail to be your business email it's so simple what happens is you go to forwardmail.net and this is a website that actually allows you to forward your business emails to your gmail account your simple personal gmail account that's amazing right so what happens on forward email is again you add your domain and once you have added your domain then you can actually forward you have different settings i actually have another video just on forward email on this channel you can actually go ahead and check that out as well the link will be given in the description so what happens on forward mail is you simply go and get your gmail and you add your domain into forward email and once you have you know uh, your domain you add your domain into your dns after that you add your account and once you link your uh, gmail to your dns on forward email then you get 
your business emails to your Gmail. You don't have to create a new business email. Your Gmail will be your business email. That's insane, guys. That's so easy and it is actually completely free. There are pricing plans. If I could just really quick show you what are the pricing plans for red email, then you'll actually get an idea. You can see right here that there is a free plan and then there's enhanced protection. Now, when it comes to business emails, people actually, you know, forget that they need to enhance their protection as well i suggest go with the protected business email because that's what we need we need to be you know our dns should be protected so that you can see three dollars and then there is a team plan which is nine dollars so if you go with you know the free plan and for the protection you just have to pay three dollars but you actually get unlimited email address and unlimited custom domain names for free you can see right here zero dollars and that's what i was talking about you can get unlimited business emails for free on forward email as well so yeah guys this is how you know you have all of these different options when it comes to creating your own business email just don't get you know scared that this is a very long process and you don't have an idea how to do that just simply you know go to all of these different platforms once you have your domain then it's very easy to get your business email all you have to do is on all of these different platforms you just simply add your domain and then get your business email so yeah you can check out all of these different platforms that i showed you and you will be good to go make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel